Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com. Today we're going to show you how to root the HTC Desire. If you're not already there, head over to TheUnlocker.com, spell like that in the address bar, and search for our How to Root the HTC Desire procedure. Okay, before you begin, this is how to root the HTC Desire. Don't try to use this on any other phone. Um, this will also erase all the data on your phone, so please at least sync your contacts with uh, Google before you begin uh, trying to do this. Uh, another thing for the Desire, make sure that you're on this version. It has to be bootloader 0.75 dot whatever or below and a ROM version of 1.15 dot whatever or below. Uh, you can check this by turning off the phone, turning it back on and holding down volume down while you turn it on. Keep holding volume down and power until the bootloader screen comes up. You'll see the version numbers at the top. Okay, first thing we need to do is we need to create a gold card. Uh, so if you haven't already created a gold card during some other procedure, then click on the link there to get the gold card procedure. Follow that, and once you have a working gold card and you're done, you can come back to this procedure and we can continue. Okay, now you need to download the rooting tools for this phone. So you click on the link right beneath step one to download that to your computer. Okay, so once you've downloaded the desired rooting zip folder, we're going to right click it, hit extract all, and then we're going to just remove all of this except for the C colon slash, and we're going to hit extract and wait for it to extract to that folder. Okay, now with the phone off, we put the gold card that we just created into the phone itself. And we're going to turn the phone back on by holding down volume down and power until we get this screen here. Now give it a second, it's going to search for a file that it's not going to find. Okay, once it's done searching, we're going to click Power with Fast Food highlighted. And now it should say Fast Food in red up here at the top. When it says that, we're going to plug it in by USB. And it should say Fast Food USB now. Let me continue. Okay, now we're going to go to our Desire Root folder that we just extracted. It should be in C, and then it's right here. And we're going to scroll down and click on the step one windows file hit run and wait for it to finish flashing okay once it's done it should bring you back to the screen on the phone you're going to use the volume down button and volume up button to navigate and we're going to push power on bootloader and you got to wait for it to search for that file that it's not going to find again. Okay, and once that's done, you can now push down on volume to get to recovery and push the power button to select it and wait for it to boot into recovery mode. Okay, your phone screen should be showing this image right now with the exclamation point. Okay, while that image is up on the phone and the phone's plugged in, we're going to double click now the step two windows dot bat, hit run, and wait for it to finish. Okay, once it's done, it should automatically bring you to this recovery screen. We're going to use the trackpad to go to wipe, hit wipe data factory reset, then wipe Delvet cache. And we're going to hit volume down to go back. Scroll down to flash zip from SD card. Look for rooted update.zip. And wait for that to flash. Once it's done, I'll say install from SD card complete. And now we're going to click reboot system now. And wait for the phone to reboot. Once it's done, the phone should reboot. And you should be on your new... Uh, basically generic ROM with uh, root access. Uh, you can actually start using root access required uh, applications right now or you can also continue if you want to load a custom ROM. Um, the link at the bottom of this procedure shows you the procedure that teaches you how to do that. So enjoy!